It starts with setting a big goal. And we set out a goal a number of years back to create a tire made of 100% sustainable materials by 2030. That's where our journey started. Since then, we've created a tire made out of 50% sustainable materials. Not too long ago, we got to 70%, and our announcement today is that we got to a tire made of 90% sustainable materials. We're moving from petrochemicals to things like using recycled plastic bottles to use in polyester tire courts. We're using recycled steel in our, 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 our steel wire tire cords as well, made through electric arc furnaces, which are much lower CO2 emissions. We're replacing carbon black, which is made from burning petrochemicals, through bio-based uh, uh, carbon black, using uh, carbon black from methane, carbon dioxide, and certain plant-based oils. the materials that tires are made of are largely petrochemicals. So what our goal is to lead the industry in replacing those petrochemicals and making a tire more of sustainable materials to create that circularity of the materials that we use in that tire. Tires uh, actually can uh, be very fuel efficient if we create a tread that has very low rolling resistance or has low friction as it runs against the road. As we create a tire that has minimal friction against the road, that means there's greater fuel mileage in the car, the car goes further emitting less CO2 emissions going forward. So materials and improved fuel mileage are things that can have a, a substantial difference to greenhouse gas emissions. So I would say the challenge is actually very difficult, and it's difficult because uh, a product that's been around so long doesn't have a lot of natural substitutions for it that would meet the requirements that we as a company are looking for in our journey to, to get to net zero greenhouse gas emissions by 2050, but also for all of our customers who use our products that want to have a more sustainable tire, a tire that uses less energy going forward. That's really hard to find materials that will actually deliver those results.